Chris with HobbyKing.com and we've got the new Afro 12 amp Opto. Now Opto meaning Opto isolation and it does not have a beak. Uh, but uh, a lot of people out there including myself is like, well the smaller quads, why do you want to have a separate beak? Why wouldn't you just have the ESC with the beak? A lot of the new flight control systems and including FPV gear can accept direct input which is a much higher uh, input, meaning a 7 to 16 volt input range on like the Naze 32. Uh, Fat Shark equipment can take 4S directly into it uh, on their newer uh, transmitters. So there's really no reason for a 5 amp beak. Uh, most of the equipment nowadays have those built in uh, for their individual components. So you can just basically run direct power from your 3S, 4S setups directly into these and, and there's, there's no need for the beak like I was mentioning. Now the Opto isolation is a really nice feature. It helps with uh, sync issues on uh, some of the, uh, the ESCs um, because of that, that grounding isolation. Um, but other than that, that's pretty much it. It's the exact same size as the, uh, the 12 amp Afro uh, V3. Uh, so as far as uh, you could even run the option instead of uh, running four uh, beaks and cutting three wires, you could run three optos and one with a beak. And, and so you'd still have that and the software of course is all the same on them. Um, and I mentioned the, the footprint and the weight and the size is all the same. So that would absolutely work in that type of application as well. Guys, it's the new uh, 12 volt, or I'm sorry, 12 amp Afro ESC. Check it out, it's up on the new items page. And as always, subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll see you guys next time.